Hi, and welcome to Carolina Varsity's 2015 week three, we were wrong. These were games from week three that we were wrong in, Matt. I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and start because uh, my biggest game that I was wrong in was Olympic independence. Mm -hmm. And the problem is, folks, I don't know if I was wrong about independence or wrong about Olympic. Olympic may be a little better than we're thinking. Independence might be worse than we were thinking. Right. Could be a little bit of both, but we were wrong. Ten to, ten to three ball game. Yeah. Uh, Coach Harden, in his article, it made it sound like he was disappointed that his team didn't capitalize on, you know, other opportunities to get that score up above, you know, the ten points they did right. score. So it looks like more on so on the offensive end seems to be the struggle. Uh, defense, they played well, obviously, holding them with three points. Um, but, but we were, at least I was wrong. I think we both thought that <laughs> we both kind of blew this game off yeah. as not being much yeah. of a game. Hats off to Olympic. The next game that I, I think we were wrong on was uh, North Mac and East Mac. At least I was wrong. I thought that game would be a lot more competitive. It was competitive to the first half. Um, East ended up only scoring three points in it. So it wasn't majorly wrong, but I thought the game would have ended. My belief was it was going to be a, a one score kind of game all the way through. And, mm -hmm. and North just kind of dominated the game. So I think I was wrong. And North Met, you know, a lot of people don't talk about them, but, you know, based off of the things you told me, um, this is going to be a team to watch. That Mecca Conference is something. It is. You know, we're going to get into it when we do the best to last, but. <laughs> There's some real tough teams in that league. And you come out of that league and get into the playoffs, you're going to yeah, be tested. Exactly. So on the forum and the thread uh, for the game thread, North Mecklenburg, East Mecklenburg, there's a lot of video in there. Most of it's uh, favorable for uh, uh, North Mech and uh, not so favorable for East Mech except for the uh, field goal. Sorry about that. It's just the way the game went. But anyway, we, we were wrong. I was wrong. Really, I think otherwise we weren't really wrong. Well, I'll, I'll say for my game, I, I expected oh. the Harding West Shaw to be uh, yeah. more competitive than what it was. Yeah. Uh, you know, some people from Harding told me that, you know, the guys, they didn't play the same way they played in their first two games. Uh, for whatever reason, you know, sometimes that happens in high school football. Right. Uh, they're a young team. Um, you know, they'll learn from the experience and bounce back, I'm sure. Uh, they got East Met coming up next week, so we'll yeah. take a look at them then. Could uh, West Charlotte be getting better, maybe? I, Coach right. Hart, I, and my interview is in the West Charlotte Harding thread. Also, it's on YouTube if you want to take a look at it in the news article on the uh, homepage. Mm -hmm. But uh, he definitely felt that way. Uh, he got Marlon Dunlap back, their big star defensive tackle, and helped him out a lot. And um, she said, even though they lost to West Mac, they learned a lot okay. in that loss. So, go West Mac. <laughs> <laughs> so, there you go. I think West right. Charlotte is, is getting better, and you know, Harding will learn from that experience and, and get better as well. Okay. Well, no eat, no crow eating this week. Sorry, but if you really feel like we were wrong enough to eat crow, we will. We're man enough to stand up for you know when we're wrong and when we're right. We don't boast too much about when we're right. No, no. Thank you, and thanks for watching.